everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today I want to cover the best in show from the Las Vegas MD Expo. And there's one product and one company that I'm going to select out of all the wonderful things that we've seen. There's some really cool stuff. Guys, one product and one company. So one entity and one wonderful little product. So out of all the things I've seen and I did interviews for and whatnot, um, the one company that stands out completely in this show, and it shows how much hard work they put in, is easily the College of Biomedical Equipment Technology. These guys, I'll tell you what, I was a little bit of a, meh, I don't know if VR is really ready yet, but they showed it. I took apart something and I know for a fact I could take it apart right now, today. Their demo was fantastic. And that's only one reason why they're in this list, guys. College of Biomedical Equipment Technology, they worked really hard on their VR setup. They, they shared their plans with me on the future. But they got one more thing that's really going for them. That's the Imaging Academy. Guys, one of the things that I always appreciate is when more than one company gets together for the good of us all. And the Imaging Academy is exactly what we've been asking for for a while. Now, I would love to go through one of the classes there and, and give you guys kind of an update and see how I felt about it. But just the fact that they're providing it, and I think it's a real positive step forward. Guys like me, senior techs, that I've got some imaging experience, but I might need a refresher. I think it's going to be a huge win. The VR setup, oh my God, it was so awesome. And I just keep on talking about it. I'm going to leave a little uh, video at the end of this to show you what it looked like when I was wearing the headset and everything. It was so cool. But guys, that's the company that won it this time. Hands down, College of Biomedical Equipment Technology, CBET. Good job, guys. That was really good. So now, the best product. There was some really good products there. And, and one of them I did an interview on. Some of the other ones I just kind of talked to behind the camera because, you know, th there might be some proprietary information going on there. But there is one product that I know is solving some problems. And I'm so excited about it. Guys, this would be the AIV PowerMate-CM, the 20 amp version, not the 15 amp. The 20 amp is what we need in hospitals. The 15 amp, I don't even know. But the 20 amp. Guys, four Hubble brand outlets. They finally upgraded the outlets. I love the fact that they upgraded the outlets, guys, because that is exactly what it needed for durability. So now we got the 20 amp Hubble outlets installed. It's got the heavy 20 amp power cord that goes to the wall. And the number one feature that I super love, the visual graphical representation of how much current is being drawn by the power tap. That is awesome because now the staff knows when they're overloading something. This is the number one problem with power taps in all of hospitals, especially in operating rooms. Guys, we can't shut down an operating room to completely revamp the electrical. So what they do, they run power taps. But the problem is, is those power taps are mounted onto uh, ESU carts and stuff like that. It's just a complete hassle. This is a dual certified power tap. So that's the, um, well, it's the 1363 Alpha and uh, 6061 something. <laughs> I should have memorized, but I don't. Anyway, it's dual certified. Guys, this is what operating rooms have been needing for a long time. It shows you how full, how many amps you're pulling on it. And if you need to check your power tap, it's got the one lead that runs through that piece of plastic so you can click on a current tap and you can read with your multimeter how much current it's really uh, pulling through there so you can verify the graphical representation on the front. These guys honestly thought of everything. Now I don't really need to do current checks on it but the fact that it's got a graph that goes up to red at uh, 75 percent that tells staff hey guys you are not doing something right, you solve problems. So you got two problems that you solve for me. One of them is the fact that it's 20 amp with Hubble brand outlets. The outlets on those things are notorious for wearing out because 
operating rooms and hospitals in general are just heavy wear and tear on outlets. So the newer Hubble brand outlets, huge plus, and the graph on the front, it's very prominent. I mean, staff identify with red is a no-go. They know it. I love the heavy duty 20 amp cord that they got on that thing because it's less likely to get damaged. It just is. Heavier cords are just more durable. So guys, there you go. Best in show, Las Vegas MD Expo. Hands down, which was an awesome show, you guys. If you didn't get to see the MD Expo, you missed out because that was a good show. It was really good. There was way more people there than I was expecting. And the fact that everybody was so positive. The folks out at MD Publishing, I am so happy for you guys that it was such a success. And we are so looking forward to next April. I got some surprises that I will be releasing because, guys, April is going to be a, a big one for us. It's uh, MD Expo's 20th anniversary. 20 years of doing MD Expo's? Wow. I didn't know. So they've been doing MD Expo's almost as long as I've been a biomed. That's crazy. But anyway, guys, uh, CBET, College of Biomedical Equipment Technology, good job, guys. Really solid work. I can tell that you guys have been busting a move to get that all prepped and ready for the show. And uh, the Imaging Academy, I can't wait to see what you got there. And uh, AIB, good job for listening to what we really need. And I think the PowerMate CM should be in every operating room, hands down. And at the price of like $220, something like that, per uh, unit, that is a drop in the bucket for an operating room. Drop in the bucket. You got old infrastructure and some of these ORs, not so many circuits. Mount one of these guys, put it near the center of the room, and look out. <laughs> and don't overload it. But 20 amps is going to be a little tougher to overload it. So there you go, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked this video. That was one hell of a show, guys. And... Uh, these guys are the winners. Good job, guys. Thanks for watching.